Hi and welcome to exclusively Equine Veterinary Services video on chilled insemination of your mare. When your horse arrives at exclusively Equine Veterinary Services at our breeding centre, we have a good look at your horse's general well-being and how healthy they're looking. And then after they arrive, we then put them onto the scales to get an exact weight on your horse. This helps us to decide that your horse is within a healthy weight range and won't have problems conceiving. So once we have the weight of your horse, we then go ahead and ultrasound your mare. This gives us a, a, a ability to be able to have a look at the reproductive tract in great detail. So we have a look from the, the vulva all the way through to the uterus and the ovaries. We can do this by rectal palpation first. So we glove up and put obstetrical lube on our glove and then we remove all of the faeces from the rectal tract and be out, we are able to then palpate the reproductive tract. We have a, a palpation of the uterus and the ovaries that gives us an idea of where they're located and then we go on to do an ultrasound examination which involves an ultrasound probe being placed per rectally and having a look at the, the uterine tract for any cysts or fluid or problems that may arise and it also gives us the opportunity to have a look at your mare's ovaries and to see whether they have any dominant follicles or need semen ordered so we have a good look at the whole tract uh, noting any cysts or any problems involved and then we have a look at both ovaries and when you come across the ovaries you can see that there are black circles on the ovaries and these are upcoming follicles that will potentially be pregnancies once they ovulate. So we're ultrasounding your mare for the optimum time to breed. We like to inseminate the mare 24 to 48 hours before ovulation and this is done by ultrasound. And once we decide that your mare is ready for semen to be ordered, the semen is arrive, uh, arrives in a pre-packaged box with a styrofoam insert and when it arrives we open it, have a look at the paperwork and then also just have a look at the box to make sure that the brick the freezing brick inside is still quite cool um, and intact and then we remove the semen from the storage and have a look and, and start to warm it up in our hand and then inject it then draw it up in a semen safe syringe and the most important thing with sperm is it does not like light and it does not also like changes in temperature, extreme changes in temperature. So protecting the sperm from the light and the heat changes is important. And we then get an AI pipette and AI your mare with a, another clean rectal glove and special non-spermicidal gel that we use. So gloving up, we then get the AI pipette and the lube and then we insert the AI pipette per vulva once your mare has been cleaned and prepped. We then apply the AI pipette through the vulva, through the cervix and into the uterus where we deposit the sperm. And as you can see, we're keeping that sperm protected from the sun and being warmed up in our hands to almost body temperature. And then it's inseminated. And after insemination, we then also check the quality of the sperm to make sure it's um, viable uh, and making sure that there's enough alive sperm in the insemination and also that those that are alive can reach the target swimming in a forward motion. This is done by microscope examination and the sperm is placed onto a slide and under the microscope for examination. And we record the information as the concentration and of the concentration, how many are alive, and of those that are alive, how, how many are moving in a forwardly progressive motion. And as you can see down the microscope, we're looking for very microscopic particles that are moving. And in this sample that is on the video, you can see that there are, there's movement there of sperm. This is a very concentrate sample, and the sperm are moving and jiggling around quite well. So then we wait 14 days for pregnancy. Thank you.